Hi, it's Dr. Laura Conover, and today I'm recording a very quick video for you to show you the importance of using an outlet kill switch in areas where you're going to be spending a lot of time. Mostly, I'm thinking about in your bedroom. Did you know that appliances like your bedside table lamp still produce EMFs even when they're turned off. So the cord that's running and plugged into an outlet is still giving off an electrical field that I can measure with this E-field meter. Okay, so here I am in my bedroom and I'm gonna show you my bedside lamp. I'm gonna turn it on. And now this, obviously on we know is resonating an electrical field that's in the danger zone that you wouldn't want to sleep next to all night long. And it's doing that all the way down the cord and all the way, of course, at the outlet. So it's not just the outlet, it's the actual cord itself too and the appliance. So you would think when I turn off the light, well, now I can sleep in peace because it wouldn't be resonating an electrical field, correct? So let's test, let's test. Well, first of all, we know the outlet is still on so that I can use my lamp when I want to turn it on in the morning. But look, even the cord all the way down, the cord itself and the lamp itself, the cord and the lamp are both still emitting an electrical field that I would be next to all night long, even with the lamp off. So, what can we do to get around it? Well, one thing you can do, cheap, easy, free, is turn your breaker off every night and it'll kill the electricity to your whole bedroom. I don't wanna do that. I like to know that I can turn a light on in an emergency. I can see, I can orient myself right away. I might need to get up and use the restroom. I don't want my outlets to be off. So the other thing I can do, cheap, easy, and free, is unplug everything. Again, that's sort of a pain as well. Going out into the garage and flipping the breaker at night and in the morning is out of my way. Um, and unplugging and plugging everything back in isn't exactly super accessible either, especially in an emergency situation. So I actually want to keep my light functional, but here's a way around it. There is an outlet kill switch, which I also carry in my shop. And turning this on and off is the same as unplugging it. And you'll see, but let's so, turn it off with the kill switch. And now we're good all the way down and at the lamp. It's as if I've unplugged it. So these outlet kill switches make it so much easier to turn things on and off so easily and absolutely kill the EMFs that are coming through the appliances while still keeping the appliance as easy to turn on and off as this, a switch. So I really love these and I encourage you to use these particularly in your bedrooms, but you can use those in your living rooms, you can use those in your office. When you're done with an appliance, you don't want that field resonating into your brain. You don't want that field impacting the tissues of your body and impacting your health and impacting your fatigue levels and impacting your mood. You wanna be able, when you're not using it, there's no reason to have an electrical field coming out of every cord. Think of all the cords that surround you all day long in every situation when you can just as easily turn it on and off without needing to unplug the appliance, keeping it super accessible at the ready, just as much as if I was switching it. Actually, I think this is a little bit easier than rotating the switch that's up here. So an outlet kill switch is a fantastic resource for the electrosensitive, which I believe we all are, but some people really feel the effects, the energy loss, the headache, the mood dipping, when they're in the presence of strong electrical fields. Um, for long periods of time. So if that's you, then you wanna protect your health by getting a bunch of outlet kill switches, or you wanna unplug everything that you're not using, or you wanna turn the breaker off altogether and kill the electrical um, availability in all the outlets in all the rooms you're in. But a much more simple solution is just easy as plugging this in and plugging your appliance into this. This will make it as if you unplug it when it's off. So hopefully that's helpful and I will make more videos to help the electrosensitive navigate this modern world in a healthy way that protects their long-term wellness. Thank you for joining me. And you can find these test meters and those outlet kill switches on my website at intuition-physician.com along with a ton of other grounding and shielding tools that are specifically designed for the electrosensitive. Thank you so much.